Good to YouTube and welcome to another Tits Beer Ball 420 beer review. We are looking at a beer here and it's actually a newer beer. <coughs> now this style has been done by other breweries and stuff before. But it's a new one under the, that's owned by Molson. But it's not a Molson product. It's a Rickards product. And we have it in the can, not a bottle. You're looking at a beer that comes in at 4.5% alcohol. Um, it's from Wilson Coors, Canada, Vancouver, Toronto, Montreal, Moncton, and St. John's. Union made. <coughs> um, the ingredients are beer, lemonade, water, lemon extract, cane sugar, concentrated lemon, juice, lime extract. And it contains barley. We're looking at the Rickard Shandy. This time honored beverage of Rickard's Premium Lager with classic lemonade is best served with great weather and even better friends. Cool tilt, pour, finish, enjoy. So when they're pre-mixed, these lemon, these shandies, they're normally with lemonade and lagers, and they're normally at a lower alcohol content. Um, but if you mix them yourself, you can make it stronger. Um, I've always seen seem to know shandies as the lemonade and the lager combo, but um. Seen some people online mix loggers and ciders and say those were shandies. Yeah. Oh, oh! I thought it was gonna come up over the top of the can, but it just rose up a bubble and went away. And I smell it. Ooh, you know what? It smells. Like a floor cleaner or something. Oh, well, all that white was gone, and now you can see the beer. Alright, cheers. Ah, oh, I fucked up the pour. What am I thinking? Just kind of letting it pour in there. And it's like, wait, it's a beer. So. You can, yeah, yeah, fucking smell is here, folks. Cleaner. Lemon cleaner. Maybe, maybe even lemon ring pie a little? No, more, more like a lemon cleaner or something. So, um, it's, um, carbonated, um, the head will last a little while, because they're not super big, the bubbles, um, honestly, kind of looks like, like the foam, you know what, this kind of looks like something out of, like, the nitrous lineup from the Monster Energy drinks, maybe. But yeah, I I don't even, I haven't yet put it to my nose, and I can tell you it's kind of like a really sweet. Starts off um once you start smelling it like a floor cleaner lemon. But right now it's more sweet and kind of like on a lemon meringue kind of a scent. So right up front, it's straight up lemon. But like I said. You can smell it from away, and at times that's floor cleaner, at times that's lemon ring pie, but up front it's just straight up lemon. Cheers. Hmm. I don't know about this one, folks. That first sip was something odd. Wow. 
<laughs> and then it kind of hit my teeth, and I was like, oh, cool, man. Mmm. This is flipping four and a half percent. Tastes like it's got a rough, oozy edge to it, a little. Tastes like it would be maybe six and a half or something. Like, it doesn't taste like it's the four and a half that it is. Comes in starting off weird and lots of weirdness about it. Yeah. Ah. That sip tasted a little ginger ale kind of taste with it, but, or maybe not, I don't know, but you know what? It's a weird, um, lemony drink that's like a weird lemonade or weird lemon ring pie-ish. And when you finally taste some of the lager, it just tastes <laughs> Like it's water, and there's a little bit of a rough edge to it, the slight little burn, maybe slightish. I'm gonna give this 3.57 decays. I mean, uh, it tastes like it's stronger than it is. Tastes weird and odd. Not horrible. But yeah, it's not amazing. I mean, I've drank lemonade before and I've drank lagers before. Some I like, some I don't like. And whatever lager Rickards has, it's a mix with whatever lemonade. It's a bit weird, so it's 4.5%. I give it 3.57 out of 10.